first from Tokula, Mexico. He weighs 244 pounds. He is the AWF heavyweight champion, Tito Santana. And his opponent. We're underway. You said this is chaotic wrestling, not Taco Bell. And it's true. That's just a fact, Richard. It's the caliber of Tito Santana. It's just a fact. It's not Burger King, it's not McDonald's, Arriba and it's not Taco Santana Bell. just sent him outside the ring with a clothesline over the top rope. Did you call him Arriba Santana? That's his war cry. Arriba. Andale. Don't make me go into the history of Tito Santana. Donde estas las chicas, Tito? That's where are the chicks, Tito? <laughs> I know Spanish, too. You are bilingual, huh? You leave Taco Man alone. That's it, Tito alone. Ronnie has got the entire one-night stand in his corner. Tito going in alone against Ronnie Delicious. Well, nobody likes Tito. They don't want to hang around him, I guess. I don't this know. match for the Chaotic Wrestling Heavyweight Championship. And I'll tell you... I'd love to see Tito Santana representing Chaotic Wrestling. Tito Santana should just be happy that his first time in Chaotic, he is allowed to be with the champion of the caliber of Ronnie Delicious, in my estimation, in my 40-plus weeks in the business. Oh, I'll give him all the credit in the world. Ronnie Delicious, a 17-year veteran of the mat game, has seen it all and done it all. And he is a great representative for Chaotic Wrestling. But in my eyes, Tito Santana, a little more above above board doesn't tend to break the rules as much as Ronnie and what doesn't bring three of his about? friends out here. It, what, has his friends done anything? Nothing. These are his yes. friends though. Oh, yes. you are you just are looking for trouble. If you look for trouble Richard you're going to find it. Well let's see now Tito's out on the floor and there we go. What? What? Ecstasy, Aaron are helping him back in. Oh yeah. Tito doesn't need help back in the ring. Yes, he does. He's an old man. He needs some help back in every once in a while. I think his life pager just went off. Help me up, Pollen. And I got, I got one I said on my back, and I can't get up. <laughs> yeah. New commercial. Yeah. Ronnie pulling Tito up now by the hair. You're watching Friday Night Chaos. This is your TV main event, the heavyweight title no. on the line. Ronnie with a clubbing forearm to the chest. And Aaron patrolling the ringside area. Oh, my oh, and God! Ronnie just got snapmared over the top rope to the arena floor. Going in alone is Tito Santana. And I'll tell you, Tito looks to be in great shape here. He's not bad for a man in his 60s. I agree. He's not in his 60s. Bite your tongue. I'd rather bite Master Sandy's tongue. Oh, please, Milo. Look at this. Now, that's teamwork in action. Oh. Why do people... Why are people so homophobic? That's what I want to know. Oh, and a group hug. Oh, nothing wrong with that. Oh, look at th that's disgusting. That's grab Fanny right there, as Arch would say. That is not grab Fanny. That that are the three licensed masseuses giving each other back rubs. Is it masseuses or masseuse? It's a masseuse. Masseuses, masseuse. Well, Ronnie has finally made his way back into the ring to lock up with Tito. Here we go. Them. I'll tell you, I am shocked that Aaron didn't bring out his tag team title belt with Britney Spears on it. You just leave Aaron alone and, and concentrate on the match. You're welcome, you're welcome. You are such a suck up. I am not, where's Sandy? Oh, she's over there. Stop that. Uh, look at this. And Tito getting the best of this test of strength, but Ronnie with a headbutt to the abdominal area. Now Ronnie's got him. That's right, he's gonna be given. Do you give? How do you, how do you say I give in Spanish? I owe give -oh. Oh, you are bilingual. I am. You're bilingual. 
Milo is my lingual. New t-shirt, Milo. $12 for one, two for 20. Chaotic gear at chaoticwrestling.com. Very nicely done, Richard. Well, with a boot to the midsection, Ronnie's regained advantage of the test of strength. Or as some people call it, the Greco-Roman knuckle walk. I wouldn't call it that. And Tito coming back up. Listen to these fans cheering for Tito Santana. Knee to the midsection stops him dead in his tracks. You think with all his years of wrestling. Climbing the rope. Uh-oh, here we go. Oh! Oh! And Ronnie just got kicked off the top rope. Oh, no! Mind buster by Tito Santana. Get some ice, quick. And the old atomic drop. Ronnie hits the floor. Oh, my goodness. See, and Tito's trying to cheat and get out of the ring there. The ref is keeping him in. Aaron's right there to tend to his hero, Ronnie Delicious. All the gold in chaotic wrestling. Well, two of the titles currently being maintained by the one-night stand. Of course, we all saw right here last week, Aaron Stevens and Edward G. Ecstasy winning the tag team titles from Little Guido and Latin Fury in a highly controversial match. That was not controversial at all. You keep fanning those flames. It's unbelievable, Richard. I'm bringing you up into review. Yeah, bring it up at the next booking meeting that we won't call you for. That is so... And I'm writing, I'm writing notes. Where's my pen? Here, you want mine? Don't be a smart aleck, Richard. And the one-night stand taunting the fans at ringside while Sandy's got the referee distracted. She's just talking to the referee. She has every right to talk to the referee as she's a manager for the one-night stand. Well, Ronnie has finally decided to come back into the ring and finish this battle with Tito Santana. Well, he got hit below the belt. He needs to, you know, take some time to walk it off. Ronnie finally coming back in. He did take a terrible spill off that top rope. And he's telling Tito, calm down. Ronnie trying to set the pace of this match. He is the heavyweight champion. Winning that title from Gino Martino. September. Oh! And Ronnie's got something in his he trunks. He doesn't have anything. He does too. Why are you looking at his trunks for, Richard? What do you mean he's got something in he his trunks? He just slipped a foreign object into the throat of Tito Santana, slid it right back into his trunks. Well, if that happened, Davy Crockett, the referee, would have caught that, I'm he's sure. He's tied up with the one-night stand, Milo. Well, he should be, well, he's not doing his job right then. He needs to go to wrestling school, I guess. But don't you blame it on glasses. the one-night stand. You can see as well as I. And Tito's now down on the canvas as Ronnie lays the boots in. Great technical move by Ronnie. And now goes into a good old-fashioned choke. Telling the referee to pay attention. I crock it, referee in this match, checking on the welfare of Tito Santana. Look at Ronnie right now. What? He just handed the object right back. What are you Ecstasy's talking about? Got a he, have it. he handed it off to Ecstasy. Why are you so interested in what's in their trunks, Richard? I don't understand it. I really can't. Aren't you happily less. married? He's got a foreign object in his he trunk. He does not have anything. And why do you it's quit, in his quit concentrating Ecstasy, on I know you've trunks. got something. Yours, Richard. Oh, yeah, right, yeah, right down the middle. Oh, yeah. Right down the middle. Tag Absolutely. team champions. Very impressive. You're really Send getting under my. To the locker you are getting under on my nerves today, Richard. So, you just absolutely, I cannot believe. The, you're no ethics with you whatsoever. And Ronnie going to work now, and Tito just caught him. Ronnie with a chop to the throat. The fans start to chant Tito. The one-night stand going at it with the fans here at ringside. This can't be good. Thank God Jamie from security is in there. Oh, God. Dead Jamie guy from security. Let me tell you something right now. He, he, it took him only five minutes to get over there. Tito fighting back. He's got Ronnie whips him into the corner. Oh! oh and he just caught the knee to the midsection. And that's why Ronnie is a fighting champion. Ecstasy offering to do some color commentary. No, thank you. 
Oh, and Aaron just went by Tito and said, Arriba. Isn't that nice? He's cheering He's for Tito. He's mocking him. He is not. How dare you? A young man should learn some respect for his veterans. For his grandparents? Rolls over. Tito goes for the pin, does Ronnie, oh. and only got a two count. Ecstasy wants a faster count. And now he's choking him. Blatantly choking him. Referee finally forces the break, but the wind's been taken out of Tito's sails. What you don't understand is Ronnie works well within the rules. He's got a five count, and he's taking it. How did you know he's got a five count? I have a rule book. Oh. I'm starting to... Oh! Back elbow by the champion. But I'll tell you, these fans are solidly behind Tito Santana to make a comeback here. Ronnie goes for the pin. Two count once again. As Ronnie continues to work over the fallen challenger, Tito Santana scoops him up oh. for a slam. Oh! Backbreaker brought him down right across that right I hope, knee. I hope Tito's getting him plenty of vitamin D. He could, his bones are very brittle now, I'll bet. You gotta be careful. You can break a hip out there. Milo, let me teach you something about respect to your veterans, all right? What are you talking about? Don't disrespect the Tito Santana. I'm trying to be nice here. Ronnie on the top rope. I don't know what he's going to do. Oh! oh! Went for a forward roll. Yeah, Looked like he was going for a senton splash. Tito rolled out of the way, and Ronnie hit nothing but canvas, landing hard on that shoulder. That looked absolutely ugly, Richard. He fell in a very unusual way on the canvas. Tito lucky to roll out of the way. And here comes Ronnie. Oh! Tito caught him in the bread basket. Once again, Tito Santana working over the champion. Fist to the face. Another one. It's all Tito Santana. Aaron fell down outside the ring. It's almost like Ronnie's a voodoo doll. Whatever happens to Aaron, he seems to feel all the pain at ringside. That's because they're a team, Richard. I'm getting all worked up as Tito oh. lands a clothesline on Ronnie. Scoops him up for the body slam. Plants him in the center of the ring. It could be the flying forearm. Oh, man. I can't wait. I hope he... Boy, I'll tell you, this Tito guy is impressing the heck out of me, Richard. Here he comes. Oh! That's going to do it. We're going to have a new champion. Oh, and oh. they just put the foot up on the rope. What do you mean they put the foot up on the rope? Ronnie put his foot up on Flagrant the rope. Flagrant interference, Milo. What are you talking about? Tito Santana had the heavyweight title in his hands, and he just stopped Ronnie with a boot. Oh, big fist. He's going for the figure four. Oh, no. Oh. Pie dive on Santana. And now all three members of the one. Here comes Tony Atlas. Here comes Atlas. What is Atlas doing out here? He has no right to be out here. Oh, and the big bad one night stand running away. There's four of them and there's two of Santana and Atlas. And the cowardly one night stand run away. Oh, there's your heavyweight and tag team champions. Oh, come on. Let's get the official announcement. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mike Crockett has disqualified the one night stand disqualifying Ronnie Delicious for outside interference. He awards the decision to Tito Santana. But still heavyweight champion, Ronnie Delicious. The title cannot change hands on a disqualification. The cowardly one night stand collectively have retained the heavyweight title here, and I'm absolutely disgusted. That's it. We're out of here. We'll see you next week on Friday Night Chaos.